scared of something. Oh, look what you made me do! Honestly, I'm Honestly, that hardly ever happens. <laughs> Day 15, let's go. Day 15, let's put the boot on. You can do it. Okay, I don't think it's gonna go on with that bandage. We could always put the bandage you had on yesterday and then when we get back, put that one on straight away. But more importantly, it's sunny out there and I'm gonna try and not wear waterproofs today. So I'm having a good time. Is it on? It's on. You in pain? Yes. Yes, I am. Good, let's go. <laughs> this was a lovely hotel to stay in. We actually had quite a bad sleep because the heating wouldn't turn off, so it was like 25 degrees. But other than that, it's been lovely. I do recommend it. If you want to know the hotel, let me know. And I'll put it in the comments. Honestly, look at Kat's bum sweat she's leaving behind on the bike. Filthy. I feel disgusting. Huh? You're disgusting. Why? What did I do? She's in a bum sweat stains were leaving. <laughs> do, you, do you think you overdressed? <laughs> I was expecting to be sunny but still cold. We could be in for a really good day. Hi, my name's Drew. I'm currently traveling around the Arctic Circle on my motorbike with my girlfriend, Kat. So far, she's been here for less than a week. She's already sprained her ankle and an enormous bruise. Hey, Kat, tell the viewers what you've just done now. What's new? What's new today? Oh, you're bleeding. <laughs> Can, you not... <laughs> Can you not notice the piece of glass hanging out the Honestly, of my finger? <laughs> why have you got glass in your pocket? I just, no. I, I just can't with you anymore. On the days when we're supposed to have it easiest, you hurt yourself. Oh, you can see that it's gone right down my nail. Oh my God, when will we get to some motorcycle content? On it? Yep. Oh. You big baby. Big baby? How big is it? Let's have a look. Oh, that's a substantial size. No, it's not. Oh, come on, that was down my fucking fingernail. I better move this away from the bike. I might get a puncture. <laughs> whoa, 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 slowly. Slowly. <laughs> okay. So how's your trip in the Arctic going so far? Oh, doing really well. <laughs> okay, so today we was going to head to Senja to do the Senja loop, but the hotel has informed us that uh, the road right by the hotel is closed, so we have to go around the other way, so we can only redo half of it. We're going to do half today, half tomorrow. So we're going to go off plan a little bit, go see some rock carvings and do a scenic route, come back, do the route that we're supposed to do tomorrow. And tomorrow we're just going to go rogue and figure it out. But first we're going over the road to get some petrol. Oh, we needed this stop, needed this brake. Now don't hurt yourself. <laughs> You're a bit overdressed for my liking. Not like now. That's going on. Oh, look what you made me do. Mm, obviously, I'm proud. Look what you made me do. Honestly, that hardly ever happens. <laughs> Let's go see some rock carvings. Prehistoric rock carvings. What kind of job do you call that? What do you call this? Come on, let's go. My right, cat now reckons that they're not prehistoric rock carvings. No, I just don't know if that's the right term for it. Which begs the question of why are we even bothering? And the rock carvings are down this road. It looks gravel. 
She said we could ride there and we could see them from the bike. I've got a horrible feeling this is going to turn into a two and a half hour hike. I think Senja is over there and I want to get over there. That snowy cappy mountain. We're walking it. I told you. I told you we would. Yeah, well, look, these carvings better be bloody worth it. If I don't get a good drone footage of that snowy capped mountain over there, the whole thing's been a waste. So these carvings are 7,000 years old, apparently. What, what do you think, Kat? I think they're all right. I could, I could probably do better. Off to send you. I know it's really good that people stick to the speed limit around here, but it's so frustrating. Roads that would be 60 mile an hour roads back in the UK are like 35 mile an hour roads here. It's so frustrating. About to go a pretty big bridge. Now pay attention, don't we, to miss this bridge. We're going to be going over it 15 miles an hour.
Harry moment when you uh, just stop flying your drone and then you can hear gunshots in the distance. Can you hear that? <laughs> What's she got and done now? Help. Help. <laughs> Why don't you build yourself a little step ladder all over rocks? Fucking hell. Yeah, so I fell there. You fell? <laughs> yeah, I slipped. <laughs> and then I was on my ass. And then I was like, oh, this is a nice angle. And then I just slid down here. <laughs> But now I have to get back. <laughs> I don't care about getting myself up because if I fall, I hurt myself fine, whatever. The camera. <laughs> <laughs> Need help in general. Okay, give us the camera. I just, there's just no words. Just stand a half eaten four leaf clover. So it's a two leaf clover, come on. <laughs> <laughs> Is that what you were worried about? I, was, I wasn't worried. <laughs> All right, time to get out of here before they shoot my drone out of the sky. Uh, heading to the hotel now, 49 miles away. Should get there for 10 to 6.
cool. We just had to stop and get a drone up for this. Check this out. We'll never make it to the hotel at this rate. Whoa. Stickers? Should put a sticker on it? Can you see that? So get the bags. Okay, so a quick update uh, on today was we went to go and see some rock carvings. They was okay. Uh, then we cracked onto a scenic route that wasn't that scenic. Then we rode on a very bumpy road and discovered a mountain region, which was just phenomenal. And we got drone footage and Kat got some great photos. And a quick update. Oh, and a truck driver tried to kill us. Oh, yeah. And a quick ankle update. Purple. It's purple. Nice bruise. People don't care about my ankle. Don't oh. have to ankle. There's some weird people on the internet. Right, so we're going to um, transfer the footage, go down, get some food, have a drink, and hopefully get a decent sleep tonight because we are shattered. Thanks for watching. Really appreciate it. Uh, don't forget, show your balls to your face. We'll catch you next time.